Hi Taurus, thank you so much for tuning in today. Thank you for my new subscribers and for the ones that keep coming back. Thank you so much. Also, remember it's not a personal reading, it is a general reading. So it may or may not resonate. So and this is gonna be a little bit, it's gonna take less time because we're only looking into their thoughts. So let's see, what is this person thinking about Taurus? Okay. What is this person thinking about Taurus? Let's see. I feel badly for the way that I treated you. You didn't deserve that. Maybe we're just too different. No other compares to you. Or maybe you're different than everybody else that they've met. Mm. What else is this person thinking about Taurus? Mm, okay. You've affected my life significantly. We are more alike than I admit. Okay. So I feel like this person is a little stubborn. Um, not a little, just stubborn. <laughs> because I feel like this person is trying to convince themselves that maybe you're both too different to be even, you know, dealing with each other. But then it says we are more alike than I admit. So they're trying to convince themselves that this is not working out. It's not going to work out. But I don't think they're having much su success here. Because they know that you've affected their, their life. Let's see. What else is this person thinking about Taurus? I know what I need to do. Okay. So why aren't they doing it? <laughs> Let's see. Give me more. You're in my dreams. Mm -hmm. My higher self is trying to reach you. This person is still very deeply connected with you. Um, we have, I don't have the energy for this right now. So right now they're just keeping themselves stuck. That's all. Um, they know already what they need to do. So I'm not sure what's keeping them. Let's see. Give me more on this person's thoughts regarding Taurus. Perfect match. See? Mm -hmm. We are a perfect match. Reason why our fire burns so hot. Ego. That's what is happening here. I lost myself while trying to save my ego. Hmm. work I'm focused on work to have more financial stability awakened love and sacrifice came out <laughs> I don't usually get two but it says now I know and understand that I'm in love with you sacrifice there is a sacrifice I need to make I'm not sure if I'm ready no, that's why they're trying to convince themselves. But something's really nudging them to come towards you. Bottom of the deck, opening up. So they're having a hard time opening up here. That's the challenge. Why is perfect match here? Okay. They want to solve a problem with you, an issue. But they feel out in the cold. They want to come back in, in your good graces. That's what I'm getting. I feel like they've been learning a lot from this experience. I feel like something is going to 
shift here pretty soon unexpectedly seven of pentacles there's going to be some opportunities here i feel somebody here is already looking at their options so i feel like it's you Or you're confused because you haven't seen anything change and you feel like you're out in the cold could be as well mm-hmm Put more on this ego the moon Why is the moon here? They didn't want to tell you their hidden feelings. Their feelings. Yeah, see? The moon and the star. They have some hidden feelings here. I feel like this person is also wanting to change. Wanting change here. I feel like there could be something that you are not aware of. They're waiting for the right time. We have divine timing here. Give me more on this jar. This jar. Temperance, yeah. They want to come and heal a situation with you and you have no clue about it. Because they haven't done anything towards you. Mm -hmm. I feel like this person also is wondering if you are already looking at other options. I don't know why I'm feeling that with this as well. But they do want to mend the situation. They want to fix whatever was is broken. They are realizing that their ego came in was in the way. Give me more of this work. Now it's like they're act they want to act out of their heart now. That's what I'm getting here. See? And reconnect. Give me more on this three of cups. Yeah. There was some um heavy, heavy harsh energy between you two. They feel they have some hidden wounds. You probably don't know about them or you probably do. They feel like you're probably having fun out there, but they have other things that they're dealing with. I feel like they're wounded. They're hurt. They know that they've hurt you as well, but they have some deep rooted issues here. That's what I'm feeling with this. Because they're, they're, they have three swords here. Mm hmm You wanted clarity. You wanted to talk. I don't know if maybe they, there was just no silence. They weren't even listening to anything. So they want to reconnect. They want to get out of this. So they've, they've been invested in their work right now. Meanwhile. Work and having fun. Maybe with friends. Give me more of this three of cups. But I see a lot of reconnecting. Um, and healing situation here. Okay. So they're stopping themselves from reconnecting. From opening up. See. See. There are, the doors are all opened up and that was the challenge underneath here opening up that's why they're in like they're invested in work so they don't have to open up give me more on the sacrifice nine of cups they feel like they're going to be sacrificing So they're in between. They don't know if they should. It 
if they should let go of their freedom. Give me more of the Queen of Cups. Some of you, it could be a third party here and they're probably with someone else with that has kids or they have kids with someone and you're the outsider. But, and they know that they might have to sacrifice that. Okay. For others of you, they feel like they're, by doing all this, by keeping their ego, their mind games, their, their um, pride here, they're sacrificing their happiness with you, the soulmate here. Give me more of this awakened love. Yeah, and they're stuck. They're keeping themselves stuck here. They know that they love you. Mm-hmm. And that they can have something serious with you. Again, for others of you, this person is married, stuck there, married in a marriage, in a commitment, very serious commitment. For others of you, this is of you, of course, you. They're keeping you stuck. They feel stuck. For others of you, again, they don't want to let go of their freedom. They're going to be stuck in a commitment or they want this commitment but they're not coming towards you I feel like they know that you want commitment as well two of cups yep there is love there I keep telling you two of cups so this person is keeping themselves stuck they know that they love you they know there's a very strong spiritual connection but right now they're in the middle of just work and they know they're sacrificing this eight of cups the problem here is that someone here left and chose their ego six of wands mm -mm. and put themselves in a bind <laughs> definitely that's them Yep. Okay, give me more Taurus. I always spend so much time on Taurus. I hope nobody notices. <laughs> give me more on Taurus and this um, happy ending. Taurus and this person. This one, not this one. Okay. Progress, see? There is potential here to grow from this. You see how they're watering a plant. Potential for a happy ending. They just need to make their choice. And I feel like they will within two weeks for some of you. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> see, I feel like they think that there is a rival or there is someone else. That you're looking at other potentials. That you're looking at other choices. Or they're keeping you confused as well. But that's what I'm getting there. Okay. So I do see earth. A lot of earth. Air. Sag. Water. Aquarius. Cancer. Pisces. Another Taurus. Air. Water. Cancer yep that is what i have i hope that felt like it resonated thank you so much and i will be back later take care